Mm. So last week, System76 released an ISO featuring their brand new cosmic desktop. And anyway, if you got that, I found this little funny service I want to show to you. Oh, meanwhile, I forgot to tell you that forgetting Cosmic isn't really necessary to change your distro. Isn't that so super cool? You see, the Cosmic project has only a few dependencies. Everything is statically linked, and distro's maintainers show a great enthusiasm for shipping it, meaning that in every and each distro, the desktop will respond pretty much the same. And I must say it was a nice surprise that System76 people are actually saying we can use any Linux we want, without trying the slightest, to tight the desktop to pop us. Anywho, time for this movie main event. Are you ready? Let's do this. I imagine you know already that in cosmic settings you can set a main window color, and then the system will try to create the rest. For example, the fonts color. The process sometimes works nice, sometimes fails, but it's there anyway. So building on that concept, there is this third-party service that will try to create the best color theme based on the current background. And by the way, Wash2 is a core Cosmic contributor, which means this service might come by default at some point. Okay, check this out. First of all, we need to enable it, all right? And boom! It immediately reads our background and changes the color scheme, like almost instantly. Now, I know, some of you, possibly most of you, you won't bite on it. It's a gimmick. Most of the times won't work good enough, especially with the non-Cosmic apps. And quite possibly won't work either with Cosmic apps when those get more complex, with more developers and more custom designs. But you all have to admit, it looks nice, isn't it? Oh, and you know there is this GNOME switch, huh? <laughs> So you can also theme similarly the GNOME apps. There you go. But unfortunately, there is this super extra annoying issue that GNOME apps need to be restarted for switching colors. Um, you know what? No matter the drawbacks of this idea, I think it would be nice if Shell, like Shell components at least, could had such a feature blending with the wallpaper somehow? I can see it will never work good for apps, but for Shell only it could be alright, I believe. And before you ask why this won't work for KDE apps that they are supposed to support color schemes? Oh well, who gives an F for them, huh? <laughs> 